Hello everyone, I'm Makaino J1. Welcome back to another Animal Reboot Battle Simulator Battle video. This is another wave battle using our first wave map ever created. It is available on the Steam Workshop. So last time we did in the Mustrack with this wave, it took two to completely complete the battle, but in the Mustrack is the strongest, so it should theoretically take more theoretical to complete. Note that the Brachios hurt is intensely has its damage multiplied by its front amount, so complete sit on the crack team. You we'll see, let's start in 3, 2, 1. Rex made it past the first two waves, but died on a third, the counter section. So we'll add a second T Rex and see how both of them do. So even with the two directors, they still couldn't make it past third wave. It should be noted that all these dinos have their attack increased by some amount, so it is sort of expected, but double the amount. If I can place it on the correct team, so four T-Rectors this is a gigantic wave. Let's start in three, two, one. Thank <laughs> you. 
So, a team of 40 has made it past the first four waves onto the fifth, but failed at our Super Spinosaurus, which has attack multiplied by even more than the regular dinos. But because of this, we'll add two more tier axes, giving us a total of six to complete the gigantic wave. Let's start again. Three, two, one. And I just realized I placed those tier axes on the wrong team. Need to place them team two. Great, six versus the rest. So our T Rex is made all the way to the last wave of the battle. All the way to the Brachiosaurus, but still couldn't be defeated. Had just too much attack. So we'll increase we'll increase our amount of T-Rexes to eight to hopefully complete the wave.
so there you have it both it took all eight tier axes to defeat our boss brachiosaurus well that's it for today's episode if you enjoyed it please consider leaving a like subscribing until next time i'll see you later bye for now